Raven and Rianne have been nominated for eviction, but the power of veto can change those nominations. Who will win it? Find out now on Big Brother Cheesecake 2! Hello, I'm Andrew Shevsik. Welcome to Big Brother Cheesecake 2. It's day 19 inside the Big Brother Cheesecake house, and this week, Dan is the head of household. He's nominated Raven of Slytherin and Rianne of Ravenclaw for eviction, citing that they are not participating enough. But today, the Power Veto competition will take place. Only six people will participate. The head of household, Dan, the two nominees, Rianne and Raven, and three players selected in a random draw, which were Ashley, Joanne, and Kane. So, let's get to the rules for my favorite competition. Big Brother, deal or no deal. Or as Howie Mandel likes to say, deal or no deal. Here's how deal or no deal works. Just like on the game show, you're going to be playing individually. There are 26 cases. You pick a case, then you pick six cases to open. You want to open up the smaller cases, which would mean that your odds are higher that you have a big number in your case. You open up six cases, and then the banker gives you an offer of, let's say, $10,000, that example. You say deal or no deal. If you say no deal, you open up five cases, you get another offer. Say no deal, four, then three, then two, then one at a time. The game ends when you either take a deal or you reject all the deals and end up with the amount of money in your case. At the end of round one, the three players with the highest score will advance to round two. In round two, the two players with the highest score will advance to round three, and in round three, the player with the highest score will win. Very important, house guests. Last season, the scores were not cumulative. After round one, the scores were erased. After round two, scores were erased. I'm mixing it up this season just to see what it's like. So this season, for this specific competition, the scores are cumulative. So in round one, the top three advance. So you want to be in the top three to advance, but you still want the best score possible because your score will carry over into round two and will carry over into round three. So it is important that you not just advance to the next round, but that you advance with the highest score possible. At the end of round three, the player with the highest score in deal or no deal will win the coveted golden power of veto. I'm so excited. I know Debbie from last season is so, is so excited. Debbie loves this competition, but she's never won it. But this game, for those of you bitching about it being luck, this game is about timing. Yeah, there's some luck and greed involved, but it's about timing. Know when to stop. Okay, with that said, who will win the power of veto? Dan, Rianne, Raven, Kane, Joanne, or Ashley? Find out tomorrow. Monday is the Power Veto Ceremony. Will the winner of the Power Veto use it to save either Raven or Rianne from the chopping block? Tuesday, the final two nominees plead their case, and Wednesday is the next live eviction, where the fourth person will be evicted from the Big Brother Cheesecake 2 house, expel from Hogwarts, and lose their shot at the $250 Cheesecake Factory gift card. Thank you for watching. I'm Andrew Chef Sakunvez, and we leave you as we eavesdrop on the house guests. Good night.